So bioprinting is a emerging area that has developed from 3D printing where we're trying to build biological structures using the standard layer by layer technique of 3D printing. What we're doing is we're printing a, a scaffold or a structure and then on top of that we will put cells and with the 3D printing ability we can carefully control where we put the cells and what type of cells we put in what particular region. And in this way we hope eventually to be able to produce full functioning organs starting with nothing more than a bunch of cells. So I'm researching artificial tracheas. The major end goal is to produce an artificial trachea for someone that has tracheal stenosis or trachea cancer. So I've been printing the scaffold for a tympanic membrane in conjunction with the Australian Ear Institute. We're printing out of collagen and gelatin mix and we're making a scaffold. Worldwide there's a growing community in bioprinting. It's a relatively new technology. Probably the most important is Wake Forest in the USA. They're probably the world leaders and we have regular contact with some of the researchers there. We have the ability to access first class clinicians and being able to interface directly with the public health system. So we really are in a fortunate position here. Within very close proximity we have major hospitals, major research institutes such as Harry Perkins, Telethon Kids, Lions Eye Institute that really are going to benefit from some of the technologies that we are developing. Thank <laughs> you.